सो हेलो गाइज टूडे इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू इंस्टॉल पाइथन 3.10 पॉइंट टेन इन अमेजोन लेनेक्स टू सर्वर दैट इज द लेनेक्स बेस सिस्टम विच इज क्लाउड नाइन वी हैव फ्रॉम हेयर वी हैव ओपन दिस वन यूजर इंटरफेस एंड राइट नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू फर्स्ट वी हैव टू अपडेट अवर यम सो फॉर यम वी हैव टू गिव दिस कमांड टू इंस्टॉल यम अपडेट यम once update yum will be updated at that time it will uh, it will show something result like this after installing updating this then we have to give another command sudo group install development tool this command is for enabling our development tool so we have to give another command to update our yum development tool once it's done it will uh, show some result like this then we have to give another command i will provide the link all these command into the comment as well as uh, in uh, github repository so that you can redirect from there and get these command easily after open ssl erase open ssl you have to uh, install new ssl that is uh, new one previous one has been removed once it's completed it will show something result like this after that we have to give another command uh, to get the gcc version for the gcc version we have to pass this command once you will enter like the it will return our gcc version that is uh, 7.3.1 now we have to give uh, another command to check the python packages which are available in amazon linux server so for getting that we have to pass this command and it will show like something like this python 3.8 latest and collected means there is no python uh, 3.10 which is not installed inside the amazon linux extra grip so uh, it's not available uh, in our uh, linux amazon linux extra so uh, we cannot install directly from here uh, to 3.10 so for getting that uh, 3.10 python 3.10 we have to pass this command this another command to get uh, the python 3.10 package inside our virtual linux machine amazon linux 2 so after uh, getting that it will show some result so like this after that we have to unzip that file once it's unzipped it will show here python 3.10 is available some packages and all and then you have to click here and give go into that directory once you will redirect into that directory then you have to configure enable optimization command for this it will enable our optimization it will start and it will take some time now it's checking all the dependencies for the configuration with our amazon linux 2 server which is a virtual machine of the cloud 9 once it's configured properly then it will show something result like this 
after that we have to give another command to get, get the end proc give the nproc command it will show something one or two like this then we have to give make and this make command will uh, do uh, all the dependencies with uh, make configuration basically make is a uh, cell uh, file make always take some time to complete because all the dependencies will configure with this make command make command always take more time we have to wait patience fully to complete all the operation once the make operation has been completed at that time it will show something result like this after that we have to give another command which is sudo alt installed now all the directory of the python it will create and install into our amazon virtual server it will compile all those repositories all those packages then it will install our install and configure into our linux server after completing alt installed operation uh, the result will be something like this it will uh, say successfully installed pip 2.24 then you have to test now python 3.10 has been installed now you have to test is it installed or not you have to check for that it's showing python 3.7 and now i have to get exit from here then we have to another give another command that is python 3.10 what it's returning yes successful it's uh, running successfully now you can check here python 3.10.4 has been installed with the gcc of 7.3.1 Uh, means in python 3.10 has been installed in our uh, amazon linux virtual machine now we can give all the command for the aws cloud uh, 9 whatever we want to do here first we are going to exit from here oh oh it's showing error no such file or directory here so for that we have to uh, navigate in that folder navigate once back and then we have to pass the same command for the pip user now it will run it will show something fully successfully installed now we can give any pip command for the installing our packages or any uh, whatever we want to do here it will work properly thank you for the watching